Hello everyone, ini Slobin Malvern, Hotel and Tourism Management, semester 6, 2017. So, let's get started right away. Okay everyone, here we go for the presentation. So, it's about Mari Berjaya. So, this company is made by me, So, of course, this is from the, of course this is all thanks to international benefits of the ice in Indonesia I finally made it here so let's get started right away so let's, get, let's start with the vision and the mission so our vision is to make sure that we can make people want to feel comfortable in our service by the for travel Or to do that is to make sure that the traveling surface went well and then and then the people will get satisfied of course for them. of course it's included for the hotel for the food and much more next what is our service so I've already told you all before Bali, Papua and Yogyakarta This time we're gonna do something that is different Bali, Yogyakarta and Papua, Papua. So our services is to give a tour that is in Indonesia and then we show them the good attraction and destination and of course the restaurant so that way the com so that way the customer will loyal to us. So the tourism this attraction and destination and Bali. So we're gonna go with Tanalot. So Tanalot is it is a very good place because it's half the history how this place is created. It was guarded by Holy Snake. As you all can see, there is a holy snake sign. So the snake is sleeping. Discarded by the Holy Snake. Don't worry, it won't bite. It's a nice snake. And one of the good attractions is the Barong Dance. So Barong Dance is one of the very popular dance in Bali. One of the good, one of the popular dance in the world. For the Bali restaurant, I consider Bebek Tepi Sawa because this place. So when we eat. We can feel the atmosphere at Sawa. So that can make us the, the and that can make us feel the essence of the Sawa. So the signature dish of Bali, grilled cock fighting chicken and fried duck. It is delicious. So the combination of the combination of the meat. So the combination of the herbs. And the spice, it's gonna make the cock fighting chicken and fried duck become delicious. For the for the location, so it's at the Goa Gajah, at the Peliatan village Ubud. Next, we're going to go to Yogyakarta. Or we could say Yogyakarta. So it's going to be Chandi Borobudur. It's a very good destination and it is one of the wonders of the world. And then the next place is Malioboro Street. It is one of the very good attraction place that is located in Yogyakarta. That is have the icon of Yogyakarta. Next. So the traditional food of Yogyakarta is called Gudeg. It is located at Wilyan 167 Panembaran at the Kraton at Yogyakarta City. There is a code too. 55131. So it is consists of rice, Young jackal, 
coconut milk, chicken, egg, and spice. So the taste, if you all eat it, the taste is very very good. It is very delicious. Also, there will be the spices as well. So you guys will sense the creamy of the coconut. There will be the creamy of it. So next, so into the next slide. The tourism attraction and destination at Papua. It's next and last. And then don't worry, there's still the restaurant. So tourism attraction and destination at Papua is going to be. Lawrence National Park. You all might be thinking, how come no Lawrence National Park become the name? So it was actually from the Dutch explorer Hendrikus Albertus Lawrence. So this area have 2.4 million hectare with the very good view. Very good view. This is one of the very best view. But the best one in the world to me is Samaras Lake. It's very good. The color of the sea is blue. It's very beautiful. And then over there we can take a photo or even take a dive. It's so beautiful. Samaras Lake is one of the beautiful place. Believe me, it's very beautiful. Next. All right, into our next slide, it is about Papua restaurant named Kitong Papua Restaurant, located at Road A Yadani Kladmak, number 12, Sorong Papua. So their signature dish is papeda and yellow soup fish. So papeda is one of the food that. If you will want to eat it, you need to use a chopstick, so that way we can put it on the plate. It is very, very delicious, and the taste of it is like a jelly. The yellow soup fish is one of the, one of the very perfect combination for papeda because the taste of the fish and the spices and the ingredient. We will be the one of the best match. The, the price of it is around two twenty-five thousand rupiah until one hundred and forty thousand. And we can also order the seafood, for instance, shrimp, crab, and much more. So that's it, everyone. Thank you very much for watching.